Hi, John. This is Brendan with Sports Center. We have today one of the most riveting tennis matches you will ever see. Uh, it is hosted at Ludlow uh, Tennis Club in Ludlow, Massachusetts. And one of the stars we are watching today is Aiden Lewis. And we have some great clips and footage from today's match, some interviews, with management, and the star himself, Aiden Lewis. Now on to you. I'm looking to at least win three games. Three games? Um, okay. At least. I'm looking to play against Steven. Steven. Um, and how are you going to deal with the competition today? Um, I'm just going to keep my head in the game and good idea. focus on, on watching the ball. Now, how's indoor going to affect your playing today as opposed to um, outdoor clay course that you're used to? I, I'm... Not exactly used to it because I've been playing here for the last couple months. Yep. So. Well, this is an early game for you. You usually play at nighttime, correct? Mm -hmm. Correct. Okay. All right. That's good. All right. You got any last words for your opponents? Um, going down, suckers. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm just really nervous. His backhand is suffering, his forehand is suffering, his serves, he's double faulting every other time. I, I just don't know what to do. I'm stressing out. Why are you so stressed? Well, I'm his manager and he really... You're his manager? Yeah, yeah. He, uh, he signed me yesterday. Oh. Yeah. I promised him I would take him to Vegas, but with this kind of performance, I don't know if I can do that. What's in Vegas? Uh, it's a, it's one of the biggest tennis tournaments ever in oh, the world so for his think, age group. You think he has a future with this? He does, but he just needs to quit school. And now I think we are on to some footage of the mothers watching the riveting tennis match today. So, you're not going to believe this, but this boy totally cheated. And I caught him red, and it's just like writing that stuff. That we oh, wow, what a cool move. Oh, just say so you saw that. Okay. So, okay. so he cheated. He totally cheated. Oh, oh wow. I don't know how what a great shot. Good job, Aiden. I'm trying to talk. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, Aiden did get a great shot. I'll just tell you saw it. I saw it. It's like the same. Yeah. It's yeah, all good. Okay, I know. <laughs> All right, John, that must have been the wrong footage of pre-match uh, conversation between mothers. I'm not sure, but why don't we go on to his Uncle James and see how his opinion of the game is going to affect the overall outcome of the match and just get his insight on what's going on. All right, thanks, John. What are you doing? Dude, I'm playing words with friends, all right? You got a problem? Are you enjoying yourself? No! I mean, sitting here in the car, do you think I care about tennis? I came all the way up to Massachusetts, took a frickin' highway, and I'm here, and I'm here to watch tennis? You think I could do words with friends anywhere? You think I want to be in a tennis club? Jeez. Hey John, sorry about that again. I think uh, there's been some technical difficulties we've been facing. Um, I'm not even sure what words with friends is. Um, well, why don't we go to the man of the hour and the uh, most important tennis player we know, uh, Aiden Lewis. All right, man of the hour. How'd you feel about your playing today? Uh, pretty good. Pretty good. All right. What was your uh, your biggest weakness today? Uh, I think returning the backhand. Okay. What was your strength today? Um, returning serves. Returning serves. How often did you return any serves? Um, fairly often. <laughs> fairly often. Really. Uh huh. That's great. How were your serves today? Pretty good, a lot better than I was expecting. Yeah, I, I agree too. Um, now, with the nature of tennis today, at your age, how do you feel about the current events of Serena Williams and her career? All right. Um, I think that uh, well, she's done. <laughs> okay. All right. Hope she's done. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much, Aiden. You did a great job today on the courts. Thanks. Let's get it done.